ambassadors of Million Solar Stars, and today we're here to propose a plan for the 600 kilowatts panel on the rooftop of our school. Yeah. Our mission, um, scaling up is one of the key fundamentals that makes the base of our organization. Um, Million Solar Stars, and it teaches students the understanding of how something works through building models, and replicas allow us to take projects a step further. Initially, make following the process of a step, model, pilot, and commercial. We demonstrated scaling up by building models of solar panels, solar-powered toys, and even model race carts in supports of Stephen Wilson to get an understanding of solar energy. And we hope to be able to move farther, as such as building a solar panel on the rooftop with the help of sponsors. These models that we made throughout the year were models that we showcased on International Day. We showed them on the desk where we tried to give publicity of solar power and MSS. On the table, we showed solar examples of our solar reading lab, um, the desk toys that we also made in MSS, and lastly, a solar-powered car. Um, we erased those solar-powered cars um, as a separate thing in science class of grade eight this year and those cl that was a pretty big event that happened this year. Um, okay, last year and this year, we both, both of the times gave 200 solar reading lights to schools in Kenya, where we also gave, showed publicity for MSS and solar power. Some of the things that we hope to achieve with solar power on uh, solar panels on the roof are like some practical things. We could use solar monitoring software to engage students through like math and science. If we had a pilot, we could test different conditions and how they would operate underneath it. What's the energy production if there's sand on it? And maybe link it back to things like uh, space rovers for any aspiring engineers for, who want to work for NASA. So may, one of the main reasons that solar panels on the roof would make it better are the environmental impacts. Using our school runs a lot on electricity, especially since almost every student has a laptop and uh, multiple pieces of technology. Having solar panels on the roof will give a better public image of what the school is trying to con uh, convey, showing that we're green and that we support, um, support uh, renewable energy is definitely a, a step in the right direction for anybody to take. This also works with the national agenda and uh, how what the UAE is trying to achieve for the country by 2020. So on average, solar panels, um, reduce costs by 40% and uh, will take away those at extra costs. Um, the consumption rate for, uh, is 60%, but the solar panels would save 40 of that. We would also offset uh, almost a thousand, year, uh, thousand tons of carbon uh, monoxide, uh, carbon dioxide a year. And this thing again adds up and shows how much we're helping the environment. So some financial benefits. Solar panels uh, give a return on investment by bringing electricity back on the, on the roof and by saving costs. So there, there'll definitely be a financial side. While the capital is substantial, it still uh, would get paid off in like five years, or uh, about five years. And then after that, it would start making uh, bonuses or profits for the school. Um, so this is our analysis and the buildings we can use. The buildings are flat and so they're really e they're good to use for solar panels. It won't be take too much work or remodeling. All we need to do is just set the solar panels on the roof and it should be good to go once we connect it to the electricity system. So this is showing the uh, model, pilot, and commercial. While having commercials also there, we would also like maybe to have a pilot system, which is like a small test solar panel, which we can then use for things, like I said, using the educational opportunities, testing what you can do with it and how they work, just so that they don't uh, mess with the commercial, which is for saving costs and stuff. Um, cost in installing solars in schools has decreased over 60% in the years, which means that now is, again, as good a time as any, especially in this country. There's so much sunlight, it's definitely beneficial to put <coughs> solar panels on the roof and the growth of solar schools, why, why don't we become a part of this increasing, um, increasing number of schools who take solar panels? And we would save approximately 315,000 therms a year. And that would go into the re return on investment. 
and yeah, it's maybe savings. So we also want to ask if we would take a, a portion of the money generated by the solar panels so that we could use it for our own um, uh, uh, for our own club so that we could help grow it and spread it as much as we can. Um, some of our reinvestment plans we want to do is for a scholarship, for an MSS foundation from solar technology, and a teacher stipend. And we got this through asking a survey, and, um, and these are the main things that people wanted, and this is what, how we decided to divide our funds. So why don't you help us celebrate the gift of uh, solar panels and help us you know, grow and evolve as a school, change and become renewable. Yep, so it's our plan to scale up solar power, to power the next solar star, and so then eventually we will, so that eventually we will help and work towards a better future. A year ago, UAS went to Kenya and came back with meaningful experiences, one of which was spent with the locals at Mekemeni Primary School, giving kids 200 lights, promoting literacy, and giving the opportunity to study through solar energy. This year, we plan to bring 200 more to give students the same privilege that you and I have access to every day. Even though these solar lights will help the school grow, we aren't satisfied. We need sustainable long-term answers. Our solution is a solar panel. Not only is it an eco-friendly resource like the lights, but it benefits more students and teachers. And that is why we believe that the solar energy is the fastest approach to upgrading the facilities of the Mekemeni Primary School. And obviously our school too. Yes. <laughs> um, so if you want some more information, like Mr. Hall, I think has all the, uh, the um, proper information so that you might need to flesh out the things. details with. Good job. So yeah, uh, any questions that you would like to ask? Also, uh, planning uh, to get investment plans uh, with GE, and we have some sponsors like uh, Stephen Ritz and Jane Goodall. Um, they're not sponsors, they're but they just uh, they endorse us. Yeah, they okay. and endorse, and uh, we also emailed uh, Elon Musk, which is the owner of Tesla. <laughs> this is, this is one example of uh, models, models, and this was grade five that. that built it. It uses solar power to uh, recycled water. Hydro hydroponics or something. Yeah. And thank you.